Go towards number 18, the Yata. Yeah. What's going on, guys? It's actually here. Welcome back to another Walls video. Today, uh, I'm going to be giving my review uh, on yesterday's game between Burton and Walls. And uh, I don't. Uh, I think yesterday's game there, there was only one team in it, really. Walls. There was only one team in it. I don't think Burton ever uh, in the game gave us any worry at all. Um, that no. Um, uh, I think it was the perfect game to come back off of. Um, uh, of uh, of Wednesday night, uh, a disappointing result um, away to Sheffield United on Wednesday night, and um, another away game, uh, and the complete opposite, uh, the complete opposite uh, of what it was like on Wednesday night uh, yesterday. Uh, Four 0 win, absolute thumping, uh, and it was just probably one of the easiest games. Uh, we're gonna get in the championship this season, probably except, um, uh, probably except the game against Bolton. Uh, but uh, yeah, Burton and Bolton probably uh, the two worst sides in the championship this season. Bolton only picking up two points so far this season. They haven't even won, I don't think. Um, like I, th I think their only two points of the season have come from draws. I don't think they've even won in the championship this season. They're just absolutely terrible rock bottom in the championship. Uh, and, um, yeah, at this early stage, probably one of the favourites to go down at this early stage. Uh, same goes for Burton. Uh, they, they, had a good, they had a good season uh, in the championship last season, uh, staying up, finishing 20th. Uh, but... They're, they're, they're like the same as Bolton. They're, they're doing all right. But they're just above the relegation zone. Um, they're just above the relegation zone. Um, they're in twenty first, I believe, right now. Uh, so yeah, um, <laughs> they're on a, a bit of a a bit a bit of a downward spiral, like Bolton at the moment. But yeah, yesterday's game was. Really, really easy. Um, Burton never gave us any danger at all, and um, yeah, uh, Jota um, starting things off in the fifth minute uh, with his goal, and then uh, then I believe six minutes later in the eleventh minute, um, it was two nil, and then. Uh, just before half time, uh, perfect ended the first half. Um, Ruben Vanagre in the 41st minute. Um, Sussy home for 4 uh, 3 nil. That was the scoreline at half time. And then uh, in the second half, one goal in the second half from Leo Bodatini. Uh, I believe in the 67th minute, I can't really remember. Um, but yeah, he scored. Uh, just to add more misery into Burton's game, uh, and that was the final score, four nil, and uh, yeah, that that was probably one of the easiest games uh, we're ever gonna get this season, and uh, yeah, now we move into an international break, and then um, and then after the international break, uh, we've got uh, a ga game against Aston Villa, the first derby of the season. It's really going to be interesting that one. I'm really excited. I'm really excited uh, to to preview that one. That is really going to be interesting. Uh, that is re really going to be in really interesting preview. Um, so yeah, no more videos now. No more Wolves videos until uh, after the international break. So my next Wolves video will be on the 13th of October previewing the first derby of the season against Aston Villa at home as well. So that's going to be really, really interesting. Um, a 5.30 kickoff as well. Uh, so yeah, really intriguing uh, game right after the international break. 
Uh, but anyway, if you did enjoy this review, make sure to smash that like button, and I shall see you uh, on the 13th of October with the preview of the first half of the season at home to Aston Villa. Until then, goodbye, guys!